That fight is just so horribly designed. And not having the, uh... Like, you, you have to have full power for that... for the last boss. Because you, you lose too much, uh... You lose too much range when you take hits. And that's the worst part about only having, like, one life. Is that, like, once the hurry-up enemy shows up, like, he's staying on screen. Because usually in these games, like, you don't... You're not taking, like, multiple hits on each life. Like, you, you, uh... When you die, like, the timer resets. So if you got there with, with four... If you got there with four lives, you know, the time-up message appears. Okay, you lose a life, and then the, the hurry-up enemy goes away, and you get to keep fighting it. But here, like, it stays on screen. So it's it's game over. <laughs> it's rough. Oh, Santa Norps. That's okay, everybody gets to see Santa Norps again. stage for the last boss. Okay. That's such a pain in the ass. <laughs> I tried to do the, the dash attack, but uh, there's startup on the dash attack. Like, I think so much could have been solved in this game if like, if it, the controls were just a little bit better. Like, one of the biggest problems is the, uh... Like, this... This wind-up shot. Like, this is the game's main mechanic, and... There's always, like, a, a slight delay before you release it. Like, you have to, like, release it, like... Sooner than it looks like it's gonna line up with how, where it's gonna go. If that makes sense. And I don't think it's main lag. Shit. The bosses can poke you and make you fat too. Also, bosses, like, they don't drop power ups. Like, only this Mickey Mouse balloon shows up to give you the. give you a bunch of bitcoins. Usually, like, Bosses in single screen platformers will like release a bunch of power ups when you kill them. They'll give you like a speed up and a shot power up and all that. But not in this game. I don't know. There's just little things about this game that. that feel like they would have been easy fixes, would have made this a, a much better experience. Are you using rotating skill? Egypt. Egypt. Oh yeah, very rarely you get a like a boxing glove that you can fire it. That you can fire out that just like travels in a straight line and kills everything. Doesn't show up very often though. Did I pick up too many speed ups? I might have. Nah, I think we're okay. Ready. Whoa. Okay. Yeah, the last boss is, uh... Supposed to be a uh, Darth Vader rabbit, except uh, he's really an alien. Alright, I'm just gonna 
just gonna duck here. <laughs> Since the stage ends when I kill the... When I kill the head. At least it makes some of the stages faster. I'll give it that. It makes the stages drag on a little bit less. Oh yeah, give me the invincibility after the level's over. Probably not gonna see one of those again for a while. There's probably some global timer for for all the items in this game. And you're not gonna see it again for a while. But that's just a guess. Because it feels like I don't see them for a while after you get, get them the first time. Who knows if there's other criteria? Hey, Santa Claus. And I, I still don't know what makes Santa Claus show up. It's I don't think it's a time thing. Alright, one of you needs to come down here. The other annoying thing is like when you like shoot an enemy and you, you you turn them into a balloon. If there's like another enemy like hiding inside it, you're not gonna hit the enemy inside it. Like the balloon hitbox is way too big. That always annoys me. Throw it the wrong way. Like that. Oh, I didn't I didn't do the stage right. I'm supposed to like rush forward at the beginning. Okay. Shit. Yeah, I was trying to like shoot the, the little ball, but the enemy was in the way. That's alright. I should get some health back at some point. They keep giving me the invincibility item after the level's over. Hey, nice. Three shots, three kills. Anyway. Stage three boss was it's kind of annoying. Although this pattern is... I think it's fixed. Shot power up right there. Shit, I'm gonna get hit. I'm gonna get hit. I'm gonna get hit. Oh my god! Alright, I'm gonna game over on stage three now. Okay, I can I can recover. Well, 
That's a can of corn. I won't be successful with that balloon skill. I already know all the skills. Oh, now we get the, the screaming again. Oh, I forgot about the spike ball. Yeah, I'm about to game over. Holy shit. Could really use some health. Sure could use Santa Claus to show up anytime now. Can't get that invincibility. Where are you going? Oh, yes! Yes, yes, yes. I only gave one. He usually gives two. And that's better than nothing. Can't complain. Let's get the let's get the snipe. Yeah, that was satisfying. Rare case of doing something satisfying in this game. Ready. Why did they have to start the the background track with a scream? Can't, uh, okay. Can I like, camp on the side? I, I think I've done it before. Uh, I'm gonna run out of time. There we go. Hanging right on the edge. Thank you, Twitchbot, for the 100 bits. Uh, I'm not gonna question it. Shit. Alright, let's get that. Uh, yep. Still not this fool. He's kinda worried about those bats. Stuck on the springboard. Good. Ready. Okay. Uh... I can't get any of these because other enemies keep getting in the way. Alright, I have full powered shot now. That's not where you're supposed to stand. I gotta get the, the, the crabs on the side. Oh, missed it. Oh, well, I can use the boxing glove. Except now I have to wait a bit. Oh, you would move out of the way. Uh, okay. Can I get this guy? There we go. Oh, no, I can't get him. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, okay. I'm hurrying, I'm hurrying. Ah, okay. Jesus Christ. This game is kind of cute. It just doesn't play very well. That's a good shot. I just need 
the other two. Almost. Uh -oh. Run off. Okay, you don't uh, you don't keep your momentum when you run off ledges. That's good to know. You just kind of drop. That's good to know. Alright, I'm still low on health. There's a health. Okay. Take this up here. So we're gonna need another another level of shot, but that's alright. Not the sub boss. Ready. Oh wait, this stage has a big boss, that's right. Alright, let's keep him on lockdown. Oh no, he got out. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Hey, there we go. I guess I should have done that. That was a big heart. That's two hearts. Ready. Okay. I think this boss is actually easier than the the, uh, the stage three boss. This pattern is very easy. I almost did a dash jump. That was probably a bad idea. Water stage. That's a bad shot. Let's go over to the other side. Looks like it's easier to deal with everything over here. That red springboard screws everything up. It up. I don't need the health right now, though. Oh, that's the strat for the stage. Just get up there immediately. And get the big fruit. I'm learning. I didn't hit it. Probably need to speed up now. Ready. Oh yeah, last stage I got invincibility on this on this stage and just blew it apart. I don't think it's gonna give it to me this time. Oh, that was a good kill. I'll take that, that was solid. Give me that 
Give me that shot power up. Always need that full power shot. Too good. Oh, right, the stage. Um, okay. Hey, that works. Uh, did I want that speed up? That might be too much. Yeah, that's too much. It takes a lot of hits. Hoppy up. I think I'm doing. Shit. Oh boy. Okay. <laughs> that got scary. It's like one of the only stages that prevents you from just like camping and shooting the thing. Alright, final stage. Again. One more shot power up. My speed is probably fine. Get up there. Santa Claus, you should just not come out until seven five. Need that, that saucer up there. I don't know if he's gonna, there he goes. The ballerina saucer. I mean, there's some interesting enemies in this game. I'll give it that. Ready. Oh god. Uh, I was trying to. Shoot it. Shit, I did not want to take damage. Alright, got my health back, but I'm down a uh, down a power up. Santa Claus keeps showing up. Ready. Okay, I really need to get a shot power up on the stage. Oh wait, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to. Oh, shit. Okay. Okay, let's let... wait for the enemies to come down. Drag this up here. Oh, there we go. Okay. All right, now I just have to avoid taking damage. <laughs> that guy almost got me. Oh god! Invincibility. I'll take that. All right, just got to get through the next stage without without taking too many hits. And there's one. I got a shot power up back. That's good. Alright, I should be good. 
I'm down an, I'm down a hit point, but uh, maybe I'll drop some health here. Maybe Santa Claus will show up again. Yeah, there we go. I could have maybe used another speed up for the boss, though. That's like maybe the one time you want the speed up. The one time you want to be at max speed, but. We should be okay, but yeah. Honey Rabbit was actually a Martian obsessed with, uh, with crane games. Now I can actually hit him. What concept? I even need to throw the stuff down his back. Uh -oh. I can just shoot him. And it would help. Come on, come on. Come over here, you coward. Oh, get out of there. Oh, that was it. <laughs> He had to finish his animation. Hey, you got him, GG's. What a difference having power-ups for the final boss makes, huh? Yeah, he turned into a DVD screensaver. Two million boss clear bonus. That was like half my score. Anyway, thank you, Ghost Pilot, for the for the sub. For the X17 gift sub, and thank you for the for the bits. The year 1994. See, they they did acknowledge this game was supposed to come out in 1994, thanks to Brave Them. Oh yeah, because the first credit got uh, got junked. I didn't uh, I didn't tell the story of the game again. Game was originally supposed to come out in 1994, but it location tested or something and and kind of bombed. Reconsidered for release in 2000, and again they decided not to release it. But then a a French company called Neo Conception International (NCI) ended up uh, releasing it themselves in 2010. It was kind of a a limited home cart release. It later got Neo CD and Dreamcast releases. I don't know how they they obtained the uh, the prototype ROM of this, but they got it out there. It's in the wild and. Now everybody can play it. I still don't think this game is as, as good as Zoopop or Nightmare in the Dark, but... It has some ideas. It definitely has some ideas. I'll give it that. Thank you. Locked in a crane game for all eternity. Presented by Visco. The makers of uh, of Neo Mr. Do. Oh, I beat my score. <laughs> these these freaking bunny girls at the top. <laughs> that two frame trophy wave, I love it. Number one. Just hold a giant flag that says one on it. Yeah, three frames on the flag. Hey, what's up, Elrock?
come on. Oh, I need to increase the game counter. That was... That was 1cc number two. 